Hi guys, it's Sissy. I am coming on today. I know you've probably seen a million unboxings of walkthroughs of this deck, the Slavic Legends Tarot by Teroteca Studios. But I'm coming on because I got a different version. The ones I've been seeing have been like the special editions or something, but let me just show you real quick. These are all Teroteca Studio decks, okay? I know most people know the Dark Mansion, right? And it's just a beautiful deck, but it's that rose petal finish, you know, which, you know, the cards kind of stick together and clump a little bit when you're shuffling, but it's absolutely beautiful artwork. And like the more I work with it, the better it works, but like it's still, when you're shuffling, you know, it's still like a few of them will stick together. Okay, so that is the Dark Mansion. And it's that soft like rose petal finish. And then I have the Elemental Wisdom Tarot, which is also, which the reason I'm showing you this, because they usually will send a, a title card with like upcoming decks. And in the new Slavic Legends, they put this one in it, which is the Elemental Wisdom Tarot, which I already have. And on the back, the World of Visions Tarot, which I already have. So these are two older decks, right? This is the Elemental Wisdom. It's an absolutely, oh, see? They had sent this, this is the Slavic Legends. They had sent with the Elemental Wisdoms. And this one here is the World of Visions Tarot. So yeah. Let me leave that there. Okay. But yeah, you can see this is a really beautiful deck too. So yeah, but it has that rose petal finish too. That's the backs and they're edged in that soft black. So, okay. Let me put... Okay, sorry. I didn't mean to make a big thing about this, but... And then here's the World of Visions Tarot. Okay, this is the backs of those. They're edged in that soft black. But it's a beautiful deck too. But it has that that soft uh, rose petal finish. But yeah. So the shuffling is, you know. I mean, it's fine, right? I mean, I'll show you like Ripple Bridge. So it, it definitely can be done. It's just, they stick together more, right? Beautiful. Absolutely love it. Uh, let's see the uh, card that came with this one. This is the tower card in the Slavic Legends tarot deck. Uh, this is gonna be a new deck coming in 2023. Uh, Maybe like elves or something. I'm not sure. But yeah, so. So all of these were um, the rose petal. Now this one, which look at this box. I think this is the most beautiful tarot box I've ever seen. That is the nine of coins. Look, she's got a swan. I love the nine of coins is on the front. Look at the side of that absolutely beautiful and it looks like a book it even has the little ribbon but yeah it's beautiful okay and it has the ts on the inside like all the decks okay and this is what the backs of mine look like and they're gilded in this soft gold but what i wanted to share with you is this is the cardstock. I just want to show you this one because I don't want to bend up the other one, but it's pretty thin. Like, it's like, a, I guess more like a low Scarabeo deck or something. But yeah, it's, it's very, very thin, right? But I just got this today and like, I'm obsessed with the artwork. There's the Nine of Coins, absolutely beautiful. All the court cards and the aces are just stunning. But whenever I get a new deck, I like to like shuffle it real good, mix it all up, and then I'll pull one card. 
and like my significator card is the queen of cups and my birth card is the chariot so if i get either one of those cards when i pull the first card then i'm like okay pay attention to this deck you know and i'll feel like i need to work with that deck and i got the queen of cups on this deck and i'm like obsessed look that's the four of coins look how beautiful but like I said, all the court cards are really, really well done. There's the King of Swords and all the Aces are amazing. But there's the Queen of Cups. But um, yeah, so I just want to come on here and show you real quick that the cardstock is different, which I was really surprised. So I guess the limited edition one or whatever, it's the like rose petal. But this one is the, look at that Queen of Wands. I'm telling you, the court cards are amazing. The Eight of Wands, that Phoenix flying with the wands. But um, yeah, it's just a really beautiful deck. I love the artwork in it. King of Wands. Nine of Cups. But uh, yeah, so I just want to come on here real quick and just show you. Because I really was expecting it to be the card stock like my dark mansion or whatever you know but I don't know I guess I don't remember it's been a while since I pre-ordered this two of cups is that a beautiful two of cups I love it love this ten of coins I think that's the prettiest ten of coins I've ever seen beautiful three of swords like all the swords are different and you have all this like growth and blood it's like like growth through the pain you know beautiful but there's the ace of swords but beautiful but yeah so oh, this judgment she's like playing a flute and like all these like little tree imps or something they're like all yawning and waking up and just beautiful six of swords the lovers strength like i just want to show them all to you you know three of cups there's the ace of wands look at all that passionate fire and just beautiful the star Two of Swords. Oh, there's the Tower. The Wheel. I feel like I'm just going to go ahead and show them all to you, but I'm just doing it fast. Look at that Magician. Oh my God, I'm in love with this deck. Look at that. King of Cups and the Queen of Swords. There's the Ace of Cups. And look, there's like this... I don't know if it's like a rush of water coming up out of the cup, but it's going straight up like to her chin. That's what it looked like. There's something coming up of her chin, but it's almost like the water is being pushed up over her, which is so cool. The high Priestess. Beautiful. Nine of Swords. That is a beautiful Nine of Swords. The Devil. Five of Wands is Dragons. Six of Wands, Justice. Nine of Wands, but I'm gonna be working with this deck all month for sure. Like, I'm not putting this away. I am like, look at that Hierophant. Absolutely beautiful. Look at the Empress. That is, that is an empress, isn't it? Look at that. Two of coins, four of wands. Love this temperance card. Oh my God. Eight of coins, four of swords. It's like a bear hibernating. He's in under that tree. Beautiful. The moon, you have the wolf and the dog. Queen of Coins. That is a beautiful Queen of Coins. Like, you would know that was the Queen of Coins, even if you didn't see the title. Beautiful. 
and the death card. Is that beautiful? You guys, I'm like, this is a beautiful, beautiful deck. But yeah, so we have this thin cardstock. It's not, it's not the rose petal. But hey, I'm good with it. But it is a beautiful deck. So, yeah. Alright, well that's what I wanted to come on here and share with you. I hope you liked hearing about that. And I will talk to you all again real soon. Bye-bye.